Setting up Facebook chat in Ubuntu is really easy. To get started, click on the Applications menu, go down to Internet, and click on the Empathy IM Client. This is the default chat client for Ubuntu. First you'll see this screen with a little introduction to Empathy. Go ahead and click the Forward button. On the next screen, you're asked for your account details. As you can see here in this drop-down list, you can add things like Google Talk, AIM Instant Messenger, ICQ, MSN, and Yahoo Chat. Since we're trying to set up Facebook Chat, go ahead and choose that, and enter your Facebook username. And then the next field, enter your Facebook password. And then we'll click the Forward button. On this next screen, we have the chance to set up a local chat. For right now, we don't want to do that, so just click I don't want to enable this feature now and click Apply. Now we can see in our contact list all of our contacts from Facebook who are online right now. When you receive a message from one of your Facebook contacts, you'll receive both a visual pop-up window and a sound telling you that you have a new message. You'll also see that the envelope in the top right-hand corner of your screen turns green. If you click on the envelope, you'll see a list of all the recent messages you've received. Clicking on one of these messages will open the chat window. In this case, we have a chat with Doris Lyford. Here we can answer Doris without actually having to go to the Facebook website to chat. This is really convenient because you can work on other projects without having Facebook open, without all that distraction, but you can still chat with all your Facebook friends. If we want to chat with another friend, we can just click on their name over here on our contact list. In this case, if we click on Jerry, it'll open up another tab for us, and we can start chatting with Jerry. You can have as many chats open, as many tabs as you want, and it won't slow down your computer at all. Now you have chat all set up, and you can get down to some real work. Let's say you're editing this Word document in OpenOffice. Whenever one of your friends sends you a message, you'll receive this pop-up window and sound. This is nice because you can see the content of the message, and if it's not something you need to answer right away, you can just keep working. Or with just a couple of clicks, you can answer the message and get right back to work. That's about all you need to know to get Facebook chat up and running. Be sure to check out StarryHope.com for more tutorials about Ubuntu.